Hi, I'm Ben. I'm an engineer at Pololu and was involved in the design of the 3 Pi robot, which is a complete high-performance mobile platform. You can write your own computer programs for the 3Pi using the C programming language, and there's a variety of free software programs available to help you do this, such as AVR Studio or WinAVR. What we have here on the screen now is a sample line following program that will let the 3Pi follow a dark line on a white background. It uses the Pololu AVR libraries, which you can download from our website, to interface with the various components on the 3Pi robot. In order to program the robot, you'll need an external programmer, such as our Pololu USB orangutan programmer. Just plug it in, bring up the programming dialog box, click program, and now it's loading the program onto the 3Pi. And you can use any other AVR ISP programmer too, not just uh, the Pololu one. That means it's programmed. The 3 Pi robot was designed to excel, especially at line following and maze solving type applications. And to do this, it's got five line sensors along the underside. The first step of the program is to calibrate the 3 Pi for the line course. It sweeps the five infrared line sensors across the line, and now you can see on the LCD a bar graph representation of what the sensors are seeing. There's one bar for each sensor, and the higher the bar, the more black that sensor is seeing. The top line of the LCD is showing a number that indicates where it's seeing the line. Um, as you can see, the LCD is great for debugging um, and for providing user interface. And we're not aware of any other robots with all these features in this price range. So let's run the program. The 3 pi is powered by four AAA cells, but it's got a very unique power system that provides a constant 9.25 volts to the motors. So even if the battery is run down, the performance will be unaffected and relatively constant. And its top speed is about a meter per second. 3 pi is great at maze solving. We put together a maze solving demo for you. So right now it's learning the maze. As it visits each intersection, it turns left if it can, otherwise it goes straight, otherwise it turns right, and eventually that strategy will lead it to the end. On the LCD right now, it's displaying the path it will take to go straight from the beginning to the end. So on this next run, it will go as quickly as possible, skipping all of the dead ends. We have sample maze solving and line following code on our website to help you get started, make your own 3Pi, do things like this.